hello everyone in this video i'm going to show you how to make a wireframe render in blender so first i'm going to add a cube by pressing shift plus a and add a cube now we can add a subdivision surface modifier oh sorry subdivision surface modifier and uh, change it to three now we can apply it now in order to make these uh, changes we, we you need to go to viewport overlay and uh, add a wireframe and make sure to take the opacity to one now you can see we have uh, added the wireframe now in order to render it we need to go to this tab viewport shading now you can see uh, we can uh, add this we can render this it is black if you don't select it in order to change the color we, you need to go to uh, edit and preferences and themes and 3d viewport now you can change the wire edit or the wire now if i change the color you can see uh, it changes to the color zara one so uh, you can render in any color you want i can see it is cool color i can see we, we can render it by going to view and viewport render you can see it renders fine now if you want uh, to eliminate these parts these axes you, you can go to this part and uncheck these axes and also these extra outlines now you can see uh, sorry and floor now you can see if i render this report render image it uh, changes to this it renders this now if i want to uh, render uh, if i want to change the background you can go to world settings and change the background if i change this to blue and uh, again viewport render you can see we have rendered this uh, wireframe view so this is the first method the next method is uh, i'm gonna add a new general file I'm, i don't save this now i'm gonna add a cube again now in this case what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna go to the geometry node and press new now you can see we have added to the geometry node for this cube so in order to make the wireframe what I'm, i need to do is go to uh, search and mesh to curve search for mesh to curve and connect this to this and i can see uh, immediately it has uh, made our mesh to curve but it is not visible in render view so in order to make it visible we need to change it to again to mesh so uh, I, I need to search for curve to mesh curve to mesh you can see i can select this and add this you can see now it is uh, rendered in in preview in a render view now uh, in order to control the thickness of the wires we need to add circular curve curve circular or sir curve circle you can see curve circle i can add this to this and uh, add this to the profile of the curve immediately you can see it has a large uh, number of radius so we need to change this to 0 0.001 about 0 0.001 now you can see it has uh, made this profile now uh, in order to make this render if i go to this view you can see it renders but in order to change the color we need to add uh, set set material you need to add set material you can see and we need to change this we need to give this uh, a material so we i'm going to go to shader editor and press new 
and delete this material now i can add animation shader you can see go to animation shader and you can you can add this to the surface and change the color wherever you want now uh, we need to go to again the geometry editor and assign this material and if i change if i deselect this now we can see if it is blue and uh, if i change this to wherever color i want if i change this to uh, let's say this color you can see it is changing the color now uh, i can add if i want to add a subdivision to this object i can go to this and add a subdivision surface and make the subdivision surface before the geometry node now you can see it will render fine you can see it will render the object fine and also um, you can also enable the object it is now wire if i change this to object you can see it will show only the wire if you want to make uh, if you want to show all the objects you can go to a geometry node select this and uh, also select the geometry node you can go to you can make uh, a join geometry a join geometry and you can add uh, this to the join geometry now you can see we uh, we we are seeing both the mesh and the material you can also assign the you can also assign a material to the mesh now uh, without the wireframe so in order to do that again i need to add a set material and uh, add this to this object now if i want to add a material to only to the mesh not the wireframe i need to go to the shader editor and again i need to duplicate this material now in material 2 i can uh, press z and again i can add an animation shader and change the color to another color let's say i need to make this red and change this to object mode and set material to material to and if i go to this object now you can see you can make this uh, object so this is how you make uh, a wireframe render in a blender so thanks for watching